And this right here is how one of my favorite inspirations, Franklin Hatchett, is earning over a thousand dollars per day using this method. And I have personally tried to use this method myself, and I have made eighty dollars in my first week using this method. <laughs> No, it's not as much, but I've just started out and it is only going to scale from here. And in this method, I'm going to show you how you can earn $200 per day or more with Facebook and Google. And this is a worldwide business model where you can target any business in any city of the world from your laptop, from the comforts of your home. This is not going to include any surveys or watching any videos online or quick money making ways. This is a full on business model that can allow you to work from home. And I'm also going to give you some really valuable tools and templates that you're going to need throughout this video. So that I'm also going to give you a funnel or a diagram that is going to summarize this for you and make it much easier for you to understand and execute. And I'm also going to give you a step by step tutorial on how to create Facebook ads which is the most important step of this video. So it is important that you stick with me. And I'm also going to give you a free email template that will make you seem like a pro at this that is going to convert a lot more businesses for you. So without further ado, let's get straight into the method and enjoy the video. So obviously with this whole method being based around Facebook and Google, the first thing there's one or two things we need to set up first, and that is that we need to go to Google uh, our Chrome browser or our browser and we need to make sure that we've got the Facebook helper pixel uh, Facebook pixel helper installed and we can do that by going to Google and we can type in Facebook pixel helper and you can add the extension to your Chrome browser now the whole idea of what this is going to help us with is it's going to identify websites if they have a Facebook pixel installed or not so what we want to do is we can use any business in any city in any niche so I'm just going to use uh, New York dentist is my search term in this video and you can see there's a whole bunch of businesses based in New York in the dentist industry um, so I'm going to use this one for example Kaya Dentistry uh, and this one as well New York Dental Group LLP and if I come to this website you can see currently there are no pixels found on this website which is perfect so this is a business we can target and we can use to earn off of and if I use this website this one's also perfect. There's no pixel on this website, uh, but if a website does have a pixel, we can't actually use them as they already have a pixel installed. So the whole process is not going to work. Uh, let me try and actually find one for you with the pixel installed so that you can understand. Here we go. You can actually see here Facebook pixel. This website has a Facebook pixel. So this is a business that we cannot target. And what a Facebook pixel is, is it's basically a program that Facebook has made um, when traffic comes to a website such as this one here, newyorkdentalgroup.com. And if somebody views this website in their personal time, if they, you know, at home in the evenings, chilling on their phone, going through Facebook, the Facebook pixel is going to retarget adverts to these customers that have viewed this website site to offer them like a, a free, I don't know, a dental wash, a mouthwash to get the customer through the door of the business to essentially get more sales. And why we want to target businesses that don't have Facebook pixels is because they're missing out on a ton of potential sales. So I've actually got a diagram here for you guys that is going to simplify this for you and help you understand how this method is going to work. And this is a little bit of a setup, but it's actually super easy to do. So you can see this is us. We need to do a Google search and find our targeted business. And if they have a Facebook pixel, or if they have a Facebook pixel, we've got to search for another business as the process is not going to work. But if they don't have a Facebook pixel, we can contact the business. I've got a beautiful email template for you guys, which I'm going to show you in a bit. Um, and if they say yes to your offer, you're going to create their Facebook ad and you're going to make your sale. But if they say no, when you contact them, you can offer a special or something for free. They will either say yes or no. And if they say no, you just got to take it and move on and find another business. So in this case, I'm just going to use this example here. Kaya Dentistry who doesn't have a Facebook pixel installed. So now we're on this stage where we want to target this business and contact them. So if you come to the website, most websites you can see they have a contact page. This one also has a contact page. You can contact them via email. Maybe some of them will have a Facebook account. You can contact them by Facebook message. But in this case, you can see you can they have a phone number as well. So you could phone them and, and call them up and say, hey, I, I, I found a way to uh, really generate a lot more sales for you, which I'm going to show you my template now. And you can see here they actually have a appointment request. And this is where you're going to send them an email. They have a, a, a contact page. You can send them 
an email via here or if they have an email like this website which you can copy and send them an email but I'm just going to use this page here your first name email address and your phone number and your comments and on top of this I've also got a whole bunch of uh, Facebook ad templates and pictures and copywriting that you can use in this video so you can say something along the lines like this I've got a beautifully made email that I constructed for you guys uh, to have a look here so I'm not going to go through the whole thing you can just read through it on the screen hey there it looks like your business is missing out on an awesome opportunity to get over 80% more customers through the door of your business introduce yourself explain the benefits of a pixel and how they can get more sales tell a little bit what you're specializing and how you can actually solve their problem and also say how you would like to boost their sales and also give a little bit of benefits of the social media online industry uh, in general and put a thanks so you can read through this template I'll leave a link to download this in the description so make sure you go and download this and and use it for the rest of this video and then the most important part comes if they reply with yes or no most businesses will say yes some will say no then you just got to move on and find another business you can see there are tons of businesses in the dentist industry and dentistry is not the only one you can use you can use sports shops clothing shops anything you can think of to get customers through the door uh, you can also go into page two there are literally thousands of different businesses that you can find in various different cities I can promise you some of them most of them will say yes so as I say if they say no move on if they say yes you can go along and create your Facebook ad for them now which is I'm going to take you step by step so it's important that you stick with me and listen to me carefully now so the first thing you want to do is you obviously want to head over to Facebook forward slash ads manager so I'm going to head over to my ads manager dashboard and you can see here I've got my campaigns I'm logged in with my personal Facebook account so you can see that you've got campaigns ad sets and your ads and your account overview and the first thing that you want to do is you want to create a campaign so I'm going to do that by clicking on create and you're going to see it's going to ask for your campaign name buying type and etc so for the campaign name I'm just going to type for example uh, let's go business let's go adverts for Google businesses for example buying type auction campaign objective is traffic you want to get traffic your ad set name you can go for example uh, dentistry businesses sort of like a sub a sub category and then a create new ad that is now specifically at this business um, Kaya dentistry so I'm gonna go back to my ads manager I'm gonna put Kaya dentistry free mouthwash for example as the ad name I'm gonna then save this to my draft and save this and you can see that you've got your adverts for Google businesses campaign and then you've got your ad set which is your subcategory in this case dentistry businesses you can have like uh, for example shops clothing shops sports shops you can have many different ad sets and then the specific ads within each ad set so the first one I want to do is I want to give a little bit of more information to the specific ad set so the ad set name is dentistry businesses the traffic we're getting traffic to a website in this case we're getting traffic to their contact page or the or the appointment request tab where the customers can book their free mouthwash so if I come back to my ad sets so if I come back to my ad the next thing is dynamic creative and offer you can leave that off and then your budget and schedule and this is where the important part comes in so you can run ads for example at two dollars per day you can see how many people you're gonna reach you can run ads at three dollars per day and you can charge the business like fifty dollars per every three days and you can make a lot of profit on this so I'm just gonna keep mine at two dollars per day and the business is gonna reach about 50 536 to 1.6 K people within every day so let's say we're gonna run the ad from 21st of October and we're gonna end it on let's say a week later on the 28th on the 28th so we're gonna run this advert campaign for a week for this business and you can charge for this week for like two hundred dollars and it's only gonna cost you like twenty dollars or not even 20 20 between 18 and 24 dollars to run this ad uh, for this business and you can see the profit that you're going to make you can click on show more options so that's that's settings perfect for now um, obviously the more traffic that the business wants to target the more you can charge so let's say they want a thousand people you can go five dollars and you can charge them now four hundred dollars but I'm just gonna keep it at two dollars for now and then the audience you just want to keep it at create new audience leave this completely empty you want to target all kinds of audience most people now will type in dentist or dentistry and add that as a custom audience category but you don't want to do that you want to keep it at all targeted people change the location obviously to the um, location of this business so in this case they are in New York so I'm gonna change this to uh, let's go New York and this is what's really awesome about Facebook you can target an audience within 
a certain radius of a specific area in a specific city, whether it's 10 miles, 50 miles. But in this case, I'm just going to target the entire of New York. And you can see that is all I want because you only want to target people in New York. So I'm going to save this audience. Uh, let's go just save this as New York. Click on save. And you can have any ages, any genders as it is just um anybody you're targeting because I mean dentistry applies to anybody there we go and once that is set up you can now go and create and construct the advert so for example we now want to add the media add the text add the link that the customers are going to see um, on their Facebook feed so this is where also it becomes very important so you can run the ad name so I'm going to go Kaya dentistry free mouthwash and you can select the page the business page that you've created so I'm just using my Facebook page um, to promote this ad what I suggest is actually creating a Facebook business page such something as ecom growth or make it a general such as uh, Facebook turbo or, or something a generic name that has got to do with boost turbo getting more sales such as growth or anything like that you can create a name a generic name you can go um, example business name generator uh, and let's go uh, this one right here we can go turbo traditional names and let's generate and you can see a whole bunch of business names pages page names that you can use on your Facebook ads when you're creating a business page you can use any of these names or a basic business name generator just to make your ad seem that much more professional so I'm just using my page J Froneman millionaire mind to promote this business and you can see to create the ad I'm gonna use a single image or video I'm not gonna use anything fancy uh, if I'm going to add picture, you can see here, add media. So now obviously with this whole business being based around the dentistry niche, we can actually come over to Google and we can go uh, dentist photos, for example. We can actually find decent images on Google that we can use. And we go, we can actually find here, yeah, this is actually quite a nice one, for example, or this one as well. Uh, I'm just going to use, I'm going to use this one, for example. It's simple, it's basic. I'm going to save this to my local computer. Once it's done, I'm going to come back to my ads manager and I'm going to upload this picture. So if I go click on uh, add media, add image, and you can go um, upload images, go to the folder that you've saved it and upload that. So there we go. You can actually see already on the right here, um, more or less what the advert's going to look like. So now you've got your URL, your headline, your news feed link description, which is what we're going to edit now. So for the headline, we can put something along the lines. Uh, let's go to the business name. So Kaya Dentistry. Kaya Dentistry free mouthwash. Now, why we want to offer something free is because customers, people love free stuff. It's the best way to get people through the door is offer something free, such as a free consultation, a free sample, a free shipping or delivery, whatever it is, something that is free or some sort of discount because that's what customers love. And then the URL, we can send them straight to the contact page of this business. So if I go contact and we go uh, appointment request, we can copy this and we can copy this link and we can paste this in the link, the website URL. So when people click on this ad, it's gonna take them straight to the contact page section where they can contact the business and go get their free mouthwash. And then for the primary text, I'm gonna add a sample that's gonna look like this, which is gonna be professional. You can use it if you like as well. So I'm gonna edit this in and show you what this looks like. So there we go. I've added something super basic, such as get a free mouthwash when you visit Kaya Dentistry this week. Wouldn't it be nice to walk into the dentist and not worry about getting charged for something to, for someone to take a peek at your teeth? Come and visit. You could put a doctor's name so you can contact the business and ask them for a doctor's name at the business's name and get your free mouthwash. We want to get you a confident and healthy smile call their business number or click on the link below to get your free mouthwash now so it's a very simple copywriting text it's offering something free as i say people love free stuff so the 80 percent of the people that see this ad is most likely going to click on this ad and you can select your call to action as book now or whatever is relative to the ad such as listen now apply now download get offer whatever it may be languages you can add english basic english i keep mine to english and then tracking the most important thing. So this is where the Facebook pixel will come into place. So you can see when installing a Facebook pixel on this website, it's going to give you, uh, if I use that other page that I found, um, I'm going to find that other page for you quickly so I can show you. Uh, it was this one here. They actually give you a unique Facebook pixel ID. You can see here. They've got a unique ID. And when you install the Facebook Pixel on this website, which by the way, you can go search a basic YouTube tutorial. So if I come over to YouTube, uh, you can go how to install Facebook Pixel. 
and you can find many tutorials on how to install a Facebook pixel on a website. Um, so obviously, if you're not sure how to do that, you're going to need to search a tutorial so you can learn how to install a Facebook pixel uh, on these businesses' websites. And as I was saying, you're then going to copy that uh, Facebook pixel ID, come back to your Facebook manager ad, and you're going to paste um, the link or the URL. So when somebody now goes to this website and or this specific business's website and logs off, they don't contact the business and they come onto Facebook later in the day, they will then be retargeted with these ads that I've just created here for you. What you can do is once you're done, you can click publish and the ad campaign will start. You will pay with your card or by PayPal and the advert will start running for the for the first week. And that's when you can charge the business, for example, um, $100 or $200 for the week. And you make like $180 profit just off this business, which is a great way to run Facebook ads for businesses and earn money from businesses all over the world. And you can scale pretty quickly. I mean, if you contact like 10 businesses a day and if you at least close one deal a week, in a year's time, you could be making easy $200, $300, even more per day just running Facebook ads businesses or ads for businesses around the world. But I want you to comment down below if you need help or if you need assistance with any of this, setting this up. I know it is quite a little bit to um, take in. It is quite a bit of information to take in. But as I say, from the, I've got this um, funnel here or this diagram that will really help you understand this in one basic image. So in a nutshell, you're doing a Google search, you're finding a targeted business, if they do have a Facebook pixel, you've got to go and find another business as the process is not going to work. If they don't, you can contact the business with that email template that I showed you guys, uh, this long one here. And if they say yes to your offer, you can go and create your Facebook ad for them. Install their pixel, which you can find a tutorial uh, on YouTube. You can go search a tutorial on YouTube on how to install a Facebook pixel. If they say no, you can offer them something for free. So for example, look for your first week, um, I will give you completely free running this ad for you and if you and then for the next week I will charge you 50% off as long as you're still making a profit just to close in the business for the first week and if they like you if they like your services they will then purchase more ads and more services from you so just for the first time if they do say no when you contact them offer a special offer something for free and if they say yes then create the Facebook ad and you will make your sale if they say no just search for another business and there are tons of other businesses that you can find but there's, if there's anything that you don't understand make sure to comment down below you can DM me on Instagram I'm at Jay Froneman. Make sure to follow me there as well, and I will help you guys out. I can personally message you guys back where I can help you out with a video call or a voice call just to give you a better understanding of this. But if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe down below with the notifications on so I can send you a message every time I upload an amazing video just like this one and just like another one that I'm going to upload tomorrow. So make sure that you're ready for that one and leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. I really appreciate all of your support. It means a lot to me. And if you dislike this video, leave a dislike. Come on, bring that dislike hate. I completely love it. It's my fuel. I love bringing out valuable content. And if you guys think this, if there's anything else that you want to see, if there's other videos or other content that you want to see, comment down below and I'll create that content for you. But until then, take care and I'll see you in my next video.